and welcome back to Aloha Baby Dolls! Today I wanted to talk about a new baby born doll that is coming out this fall in Germany and I hope it will be available in other countries too. Recently one of my followers on Instagram named KikiSara23 has shared with me that one of her friends named Zaf Maniac was visiting a toy fair in Germany this year and saw some new baby borns that are being introduced this year. So I wanted to give shout out to Kiki Sarah 23 and Zaf Maniac and they both have Instagram by that name and YouTube channels. So if you would like to check their um, Instagram and YouTube, I will link it in the description below. And I wanted to thank these people for bringing this to my attention so I can share it with you. Are you excited to see the new baby born 2018 doll? Well, let's take a look at some pictures, read a little bit of info about them, and at the end I will share with you a clip from Germany's Toy Fair featuring baby born dolls. So here they are, look how cute! They've got new outfits, and as usual there is a Caucasian boy with brown eyes, Caucasian girl with blue eyes, and an ethnic doll with brown eyes. As you can see, they don't look that much different. In fact, I'm pretty sure they were using the same mold of the doll, but there are several things that are gonna be definitely improved on this doll. Here we see an ethnic baby doll with her accessories. She comes with a onesie, a cute little hat, a bowl, spoon, baby food, her diaper, potty, bottle, her birth certificate, and a cute pacifier with a passy clip. And if you notice, they have changed the shape of the pacifier, and I like that very much. They are also going to have some new accessories for baby born dolls in general, like new outfits and the scooter they can drive. This year, they also will have a baby born brother. We have seen baby born sister before with cute blonde hair and blue eyes. But now we're going to see a baby born brother with brown hair and I think brown eyes. I wonder if this is what Emma and Ethan will look like when they grow up. Let me know in the comments what do you think of them. Here's another picture of the new baby born soft touch baby here on the display at the toy fair. And it shows them uh, with their passies in their mouth which looks really cute. The bowl looks totally different and it looks like they're able to hold it now. And some of the diapers appear to be different. It appears that boy diaper now looks blue, so that's nice. Here's close up of their pacifiers, so look how cute. I think this shape of pacifier looks so much better on their faces than the older one. I've always felt like the older one just covered too much of their face. And this one looks more like a real baby pacifier. So here is an article about the new baby born soft touch and for those of you who may know the German language, you can probably understand and read everything about it and I'll put the link to this website in my description as well. But for those of us who don't understand the language like me, I'm going to read the translation from Google Translate. It says, small and big fans have eagerly waited for this. Zav Creation AG presents the new baby born soft touch with its revolutionary soft body. This replaces the hard body of the baby born doll, which has not necessarily invited to cuddle. So true. With the new soft body, the baby born soft touch feels softer. Of course, she will still have all the features like sleeping, crying, eating and drinking. The small and the big gear on the potty, the popular diaper changes, as well as bathing and moving the arms and legs. The triggering of the tear function was additionally optimized. Instead of pressing the arm, the tears now roll much easier when you press on the new soft baby born chest. But not only the feel has improved with the soft body, the aesthetics of the new baby born soft touch leaves nothing to be desired. The new navel button, which lets the doll trigger the big and small business, is now placed under the new soft skin of the baby born soft touch during the revision which ensures a much more natural aesthetics of the doll. Even more lifelike fun and flexibility thanks to soft body. 
In addition to the new feel and the revised navel, the baby born doll also shines through more flexibility. Because the arms of the new baby born soft touch can not only be moved vertically, but also horizontally. Wow, I think what they mean is that her arms will be moving just like the 2006 Soft Face Baby Alive doll or Learns to Potty doll. Wow, that would be really great. As a result, the doll almost begs the little doll parents to hug them and it is also much easier to change clothes. That is great. Are you guys excited for the new Baby Born Soft Touch? I sure am. The only thing is, they're probably not going to be available in the US until much later. So if any of you know how we can get the new Baby Born dolls, please let us know because we would love to have them on our channel, review them, play with them, and have lots of videos with them for you to enjoy. So before I show you the clip from the Toy Fair, which will be in German language, let's review. The new Baby Born Soft Touch doll will have the same or very similar appearance, different clothes, a different passy with a pacifier clip, a different feeding bowl and spoon, they will be much more cuddlier and much more easier to dress. They will still have all the functions that they have now, but it will be easier to make them cry tears and change them and hug them and love them for a long time. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this video today. If you did, please give us a like and share this video with your friends. We post baby born videos every Friday. So be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any of our new videos with them. And we'll see you next time. On to the video now! Franken Live heute, unser Thementag. Es dreht sich alles um die Puppen und wir sind angelangt hier bei Zap Kreationen, schon lange, lange Jahre ja mit dabei, hier in Halle 12 zu finden. Und da darf ich jetzt den Vice President Corporate Marketing begrüßen. Das ist Herr Martin Rogler. Grüß Sie Gott. Hallo. Ja, vieles Neues gibt es. Sie haben es gerade schon so ein bisschen angedeutet. Es wird weich bei Babyborn. Genau, Babyborn ist ja kein neues Konzept. Die ist ja schon 27 Jahre alt. Aber das erste Mal in 27 Jahren bekommt die Babyborn jetzt einen weichen Körper. Dann macht das Schmusen noch mehr Spaß. Ja, vorher war es ja doch so, dass man eher den kleinen Bruder damit hauen konnte. Aber jetzt ist es natürlich richtig zum Kuscheln und Schmusen. Ganz genau. Und Babyborn hat einen Bruder. Auch das ganz neu, Sister and Brother. Genau, die Schwester hat es ja schon vor einigen Jahren bekommen und jetzt hat sie ganz überraschend festgestellt, dass sie auch noch einen älteren Bruder hat und der ist ab diesem Jahr dann eben auch zu finden. Die Babyborn-Familie wächst, natürlich braucht man auch das entsprechende Zubehör, das gibt es bei Ihnen natürlich ja auch zu sehen. Gibt es da denn irgendwelche Neuigkeiten? Ja, da gibt es natürlich wie jedes Jahr ganz viele Neuigkeiten. Also das fängt an, dass es für Babyborn und die Schwester einen ganz tollen Motorroller gibt, aber es wird auch eine riesige Boutique geben, also ein Kleiderladen für die Babyborn mit ganz vielen tollen Zubehörteilen. Franken Live heute, unser Thementag. Es dreht sich alles um die Puppen und wir sind angelangt hier bei Zap Kreationen, schon lange, lange Jahre ja mit dabei, hier in Halle 12 zu finden. Und da darf ich jetzt den Vice President Corporate Marketing begrüßen. Das ist Herr Martin Rogler. Grüß Sie Gott. Hallo. Ja, vieles Neues gibt es. Sie haben es gerade schon so ein bisschen angedeutet. Es wird weich bei Babyborn. Genau, Babyborn ist ja kein neues Konzept. Die ist ja schon 27 Jahre alt. Aber das erste Mal in 27 Jahren bekommt die Babyborn jetzt einen weichen Körper. Dann macht das Schmusen noch mehr Spaß. Ja, vorher war es ja doch so, dass man eher den kleinen Bruder damit hauen konnte. Aber jetzt ist es natürlich richtig zum Kuscheln und Schmusen. Ganz genau. Und Babyborn hat einen Bruder, auch das ganz neue Sister and Brother. Genau, die Schwester hat es schon vor einigen Jahren bekommen. Und jetzt hat sie ganz überraschend festgestellt, dass sie auch noch einen älteren Bruder hat. Und der ist ab diesem Jahr dann eben auch zu finden. Die Babyborn-Familie wächst. Natürlich braucht man auch das entsprechende Zubehör. Das gibt es bei Ihnen natürlich ja auch zu sehen. Gibt es da denn irgendwelche Neuigkeiten? Ja, da gibt es natürlich wie jedes Jahr ganz viele Neuigkeiten. Also das fängt an, dass es für Babyborn und die Schwester einen ganz tollen Motorroller gibt. Aber es wird auch eine riesige Boutique geben, also einen Kleiderladen für die Babyborn mit ganz vielen tollen Zubehörteilen. Ja, bald in den Geschäften heute hier bei uns auf der Spielwarenmesse in Nürnberg. Franken Live ist noch ein bisschen unterwegs und herzlichen Dank an Herrn Rogler. Gerne.